My name is James Kavna and I'm a Snapchatter um, type of person. Uh, media tend to call types that I am influencers, even though I hate that word. Um, but I basically Snapchat my life and I work with different brands which kind of help pay the bills because I've I guess I've like a large audience of young people that brands want to tap into so sometimes they come to me for like brand collaborations and stuff and I guess that's how I ha that's how the bills are helped paid um, and then I also run a food company with my boyfriend called Kerbini which we're kind of aiming to to launch Kerbini is a food brand I've started with my boyfriend William uh, he's from a place called Kerbini in Cork um, it's really picturesque, it's very Enid Blythney. Like if you run out of milk and sugar, you have to get a little dinghy across to the shop um, to get all the ingredients. So we spent like loads of weeks there during the summer and that's kind of when we, I guess, got talking about what kind of, we wanted to get into food together because he had just finished studying in Malou. I was working on Kerrygold butter, so we were both in a very foodie kind of place and we were loving it. So we're like, let's turn this into a career. So um, I want to have two cafes. I want one in Dublin and one in Cork. Um, we have a cookbook coming out in spring 2018. Um, so I want to have at least one of the cafes. There will definitely only be one of the cafes up and running by then. Probably cafe two in like five years after that. So yeah, I want to make a little mini food empire. Uh, so I set up this group called The Hun Real Issues with my friend Andrea. She owns Tropical Pop called Nail Bar. And um, the whole idea behind that was to try and get like people who wouldn't normally care about this involved and caring a bit more. So we worked with Macer and we made this kind of big giant heart mural in Tampa Bar. Um, and then from that we made t-shirts and stuff like that because in a way we kind of wanted to make um, Repeal the Eighth a bit accessible and a bit like the marriage referendum. They had like the yes badges and you know people could get involved in a sense without you know pontificating or talking to masses they could wear a t-shirt and feel involved and it was just an, a simple way for people to get involved so that was the the aim from the outset was to just make easy ways for people to start a conversation about repeal the eighth so that's kind of what i'm doing with them at the moment there's loads of lovely little cafes i like going to the pepper pot and um, i like going for coffee and um, i'm not a very dewy person like i just kind of like I love my own company and I love just walking around and I could stare at a window for like an hour. Um, I, yeah, going for coffee and just being at one with yourself and wandering is my favourite thing to do. Is that the cat? <laughs> <laughs>